Hi. The test today will be done with local PC and laptop both being on two different network providers. As you can see in this notepad, we have written down the steps that will be required to get you and your friends connected online and play any LAN games. Just watch and follow the steps. Also please understand the client has been updated and the user interface looks better. This is the very first video made as I had time to make it. When time permits me, I will make more. Okay, now, the PC user is logging into the main server lobby, selecting a chat room and join the session, just enter any username and press login button. Okay, once logged in, you will come to this main chat lobby, here you meet and greet everybody, chat and discuss about hosting a game or joining a game. Okay, now the laptop user will use any username and press the login button and join the same chat room as the PC user. You do not have to be in the same chat room, you can join any chat room as you wish, but to see chat message, you need to be in the same room to see chat room messages. Now that both are logged in, they can see each other's username in the same room. The PC user has already created the server from zero tier tab, and now he will create a host for others to join to his network. Just click the host button. On the next page, select how many players and you're done. Let others join your host. Remember add a game description what you are playing otherwise nobody will know what game you're hosting. This is your host screen, people will now see your server listed all over and able to join your session by double-clicking on your server to join your host. Okay, now let's go to the laptop and check what we can see. Here from this laptop, we can see the PC user has created a host, let's double click on it and join him. After you double click on it, it will open this screen and here you will see all the users that are joined in this hosted room. Feel free to chat to the users. Also the admin will let you know when to start the game. Okay, now we just showing you on both end that users have joined successfully and now ready for the final step. Now the final step is, the person hosting the room will press join all users to your server button, and this will get everybody connected to you instantly on the same network. Keep an eye on that status text. Once you are connected, the status will say joined and the rest of the users will get connected immediately. Now look at the laptop user status bar and the windows bar pop up. Whenever that windows bar pop up with yes and no don't click it and just click in middle of the screen. Okay, that's it boys and girls it is done, you can play any games you want. Here now the PC user starts a game, creates a host and game just watch. Your games must have offline LAN options though. Just like it is shown in the video. You can play games from GOG, Reloaded, Codex, and others as long the file is cracked properly you are good. Here now, the PC user is just creating a host for the laptop user to find and join. I have demanding games on PC, but to transfer them to my laptop is large files, and I will too lazy to do that. I will do what I can to make new videos on different games when time permits me. Okay, now, the laptop user just minimized the client app and now will run the same game, go to the lawn area, and find the hosted game. Okay, now watch as the laptop user goes to the lawn section, he will see the PC user listed there. Just double click and join, do what you do from here to play. The client has done his job.
It is now all up to the users what games you wish to play. Here the PC user is making the game and joining. Funny thing is the PC user's name is hooked to GameRangers.ini file lol. Anyways look the game list can be seen on laptop now. The laptop user joins and plays. The speed and ping are great, no lags, whatsoever. Guys, just to let you know, I have created this client tool so that it can work along zero tier to ease our task. The build of this client started just three weeks ago from the date I uploaded another video, same as this, without any voiceovers. And I have created a website in a very short time. I do not care how the website looks or the user interface in the final release of this client as long as it gets the job done, that all it matters. And guys as from here at this timeline, no more voiceovers will be heard as it is not needed for the rest of this video. The rest of the video just shows you playing different games, so no voiceover needed. Also, just to let you know, once a user exits the host, the server gets auto-disconnected from you and gets deleted. So, whenever you join, leave a host the server you are connected to gets disconnected and removed, and now you will be ready to join other people's game again just like you've seen from the start of this video. Okay voiceover ends here, thanks for watching and download and test it yourself. Please watch other video, I posted small tutorials how to create servers before you host a game. If you are not hosting, then you do not need a server. If you are hosting, then you need a server. I have three channels posted the same content. Look for the videos and watch it all.